Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're diving into the world of epic tech fails. Yes, even the tech giants mess up sometimes. Now let's start with the behemoth Google. Remember Google Glass? Those fancy augmented reality glasses that were supposed to revolutionize the way we interact with the world? Well, they flopped, hard. Despite the hype, consumers found them creepy and invasive. And don't even get me started on the hefty price tag. Next, let's talk about Microsoft. They've had their fair share of blunders, but nothing tops the Zune. This was Microsoft's answer to the iPod, but it turned out to be a question no one was asking. Despite a sleek design and decent features, the Zune was a commercial disaster. It was a classic case of too little, too late. And who can forget Amazon's Fire Phone? This smartphone was supposed to be a game changer, but it went up in smoke almost immediately. Poor sales, negative reviews, and a lack of unique features led to its downfall. It's a reminder that even the most successful companies can't always break into new markets. Now let's not leave out Apple. Yes, even the mighty Apple has had its share of flops. Remember the Newton? This handheld device was supposed to be the future of personal computing, but it was too big, too expensive, and too ahead of its time. It was a rare miss for a company known for its innovation. And finally, let's talk about Facebook. Or should I say, Facebook Home. This was an Android launcher that aimed to integrate Facebook into every aspect of your phone. But users found it intrusive and unnecessary, leading to its swift demise. These epic fails serve as a reminder that even the biggest tech companies aren't immune to mistakes. They push boundaries, take risks, and sometimes, they fail. But each failure is a stepping stone to success, a lesson learned, a chance to grow and innovate. Wow, even the biggest tech giants can stumble. Let's see what other tech blunders we can dig up. Failure isn't exclusive to the big guys. It seems the rest of the tech world has had its fair share of blunders. Let's explore some more. Now, we're jumping into the world of lesser-known tech fails. You know, those smaller companies and startups that dared to dream big, but fell a little short, or in some cases, a lot short. First up, we have the story of a company that ambitiously ventured into the world of wearable tech. They aimed to create a device that could track your every move, your every heartbeat, your every calorie. The device was sleek, stylish, and unfortunately, not very accurate. You see, in their rush to beat the competition to market, they overlooked one minor detail, testing. It turns out the device was not so great at tracking anything at all. Can you imagine the disappointment of the fitness enthusiasts who shelled out their hard-earned cash for this? Then we have the tale of a quirky startup that thought they had the next big social media platform on their hands. They promised a space where users could connect and share with total freedom, with no algorithms, no ads, just pure connection. Sounds great, right? Well, the problem was, they launched without any sort of moderation system in place. The platform quickly became a haven for spam and inappropriate content, users fled en masse, and the platform was deserted within months. And let's not forget about the tech firm that attempted to revolutionize the smartphone market with their own version of a foldable phone. The concept was intriguing, the design was sleek, but the execution was, well, let's just say less than perfect. The phone had a tendency to break along the fold within days of use. The company had to recall every unit, leading to huge financial losses and a damaged reputation. So what happened next? Well, these companies had to face the music. Some managed to pivot and find a new direction. Others had to shut their doors for good. From flying too close to the sun to just plain bad ideas, the tech world is full of epic fails. But the show isn't over yet. Sometimes you can't help but wonder, what were they thinking? Let's look at some tech fails that defy logic. Let's start with a classic, the Apple Newton. This was a personal digital assistant launched back in the 90s. It was supposed to revolutionize note-taking with its handwriting recognition feature. Only one problem, the handwriting recognition was, well, terrible. It often turned simple notes into a jumbled mess of nonsense. Imagine typing, meet me at the cafe, and it translates to meet B hat the safe. Not exactly the revolution Apple was hoping for. Critics had a field day, and consumers, well, they weren't exactly thrilled either. Then there was Microsoft's Windows Vista. This operating system was hyped up to be the next big thing in personal computing. Unfortunately, it was more like the next big flop. Users complained of slow performance, constant crashes, and compatibility issues. It was like driving a brand new car that breaks down every other mile. Tech experts were scratching their heads, asking, did Microsoft even test this thing? And remember the Google Glass? This wearable tech gadget was supposed to bring the internet right to your eyeballs. 
but it ended up being more of a privacy nightmare than a helpful tool. People didn't appreciate the idea of being potentially recorded without their consent. It led to some awkward conversations and even bans in certain places. The public's reaction was clear. No Google, we don't want a camera on our faces 24-7. And even more about the Amazon Fire Phone. This smartphone was supposed to be a game changer, but it ended up being a monumental flop. The Fire Phone was overpriced, underwhelming and tied too closely to Amazon's ecosystem. Consumers just weren't buying it, literally. It left many people wondering, what was Amazon thinking? I bet those tech companies wish they could hit the undo button, but there's a lot that they and us can learn from it to see a trend of what is needed. While it's fun to laugh at these tech fails, there are also lessons to be learned. Let's see what we can take away from these blunders. First and foremost, let's remember that failure is not the end of the road, but rather an opportunity to learn and grow. These tech giants, despite their blunders, are still standing tall, aren't they? That's because they took their failures, dusted themselves off, and used them as stepping stones to success. Second, it's crucial to understand your customer. Many of these tech fails happened because the companies failed to understand what their customers really wanted or needed. So listen to your audience, do your market research, and always, always put the customer first. Third, testing is key. Many of these products would have never made it to the market if they had been properly tested. So before you launch, make sure to exhaustively test your product because your reputation is on the line. Lastly, never be afraid to innovate. Many of these tech fails were the result of bold, innovative ideas that didn't quite pan out, but that doesn't mean we should stop trying. Innovation is the lifeblood of the tech industry, and without it, we wouldn't have many of the amazing products we enjoy today. So the next time you make a mistake, remember, even the tech giants mess up. Well, that was a wild ride, I hope you enjoyed our tour of these tech fails as much as I did. Today, we journeyed through some major fails of tech titans, pondered whether more is always merrier, and questioned some questionable decisions. But remember, it's all about learning from past mistakes and striving for continuous improvement. So, what's your favorite tech fail? Drop a comment below if you remember seeing them fail when they came out. If you want to stay ahead of the curve and keep up with the latest breakthroughs in these awe-inspiring fields, make sure to hit that subscribe button and join the What's Good community. Stay tuned for more exciting content on the latest tech trends. Hope you enjoyed and come back for more of What's Good.